Today we will take a quick look at some of the new features of Accordance version 14. First, there is a new Quick Click Verse Picker icon in all texts. Just click once to see a pop-up of Bible books. Select the book, then chapter, and then verse. No typing is required. Next is the Dynamic Word Study feature. From any translation with key numbers or any morphologically tagged original language text, you can launch the Dynamic Word Study pane. Right-click on a word, choose Word Study, then Word or Key Number. I'll choose Word. Instantly, another zone opens with a wealth of information. First is the word count, followed by the word definition, from the default dictionary you have set in Preferences in the Amplify setting. If your default dictionary does not list the word, Webster's is the secondary dictionary. Click on More to open the book in its own zone. Next is Text Compare. The first column looks at your default text. Click on the plus sign to open the next text listed in your library folder, and so on up to five texts. Next is the Word Pie Graph, displaying results in the pie chart. Click on the section to see the verses. Click on the plus sign to see up to six translations. There is also a word bar graph and a frequency graph, as well as a dictionary section. Now we will right-click on the word and select Word Study and Key Number. This opens the dictionary set to Key Number in the Amplify setting. Here you will see a list of English words used for that key number. Let's add a parallel Hebrew text and right-click on the same word, select Word Study, and Lexeme. A Hebrew dictionary opens. Text Compare, a pie graph, a word bar graph, frequency graph, and other resources also show in the window. If you prefer, you can place the Word Study tool on your main toolbar. Then quickly open the Word Study window by selecting a word and clicking on the tool. User Tools has new features enabling you to create your own dictionaries, lexicons, and commentaries. Go to File, User File, New User Tool, and select an option. User Tools are now 100% Unicode compatible. They are listed in the library in the My Stuff section. Accordance makes it easy to instantly switch to Dark Mode by clicking on the Dark Mode tool. Another new feature is Custom Phrasing. Place your cursor where you want to begin in a text window. Click on the gear or use keyboard shortcuts as shown and select Phrasing. Let's add a line break. And now we can add an indent. You can hide or lock the phrasing. You can also delete your phrasing. Workbooks now have an easy answer option. The cursor will change to a pencil. Type your answers in editable fields in the study guide or workbook. Here's an example of easy answers in a grammar workbook. The files are found on your computer, in Documents, Accordance Files, and Answers. 
New citation formats are available in the Bibliography setting in Preferences. Here's a final quick tip. If a search is remaining active, click on the magnifying glass at the beginning of the search bar and clear the history. We will post several other videos in our recordings on our GoToTraining channel as well as the Accordance website under support and our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.